Yeah, hi there. These comments are for uh, Aoi, and I am Michael, and I'm going to answer some of your questions uh, in the email that you sent me. You say, I am interested in the package of writing practices you mentioned. Would you direct me where I can find the information? Yes. Here's what you want to do. Tell me how many practice tests you want me to video correct, and then I will offer you a discount, and I'll send you an invoice so you can purchase that package. So, for example, if you, wanna, if you want me to error correct 10 writing practice tests, right, I'll offer that at $40 a piece, so then I'll send you an invoice for $400 for that. All right, so that's what I would recommend there. Uh, your second question, I will take the speaking course. I will notify you once I submit the payment. Okay, sounds good. Also, if you want me to send you the speaking invoice, I can also do that. Uh, you say, as your course instructed, I took a test on ScoreNexus website. My writing score was 3 out of 5. The comments say I do not need to write a conclusion, but should spend time in other paragraphs in the integrated writing test. Your lecture suggests to write a short summary. Uh, it's okay either way. You don't have to use, you don't have to have an introduction, uh, in, I mean a conclusion, in the integrated writing task and your introduction doesn't really need to be very long. So if you have time you can have maybe a short sentence at the end of the integrated writing to kind of tie up loose ends. If you do not use one or don't have a conclusion you'll still score high on that. All right, so there you go. And uh, thank you for your questions. Keep up the good work.